In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful. Hello, my students. Today, inshallah, we are going to revise to module one. هنرجع اليوم على الوحدة الأولى اللي انتهينا من دراستها. Open your students book. افتح كتاب الطالب page twelve صفحة اتناشر. We have two activities. Activity one is a listening activity. هذا تدريب استماع. Listen and write the occupation of each person. هنكتب مهنة كل شخص. We have some occupations here. معنا هنا بعض المهن أو الوظائف. There is one extra word. فيهم كلمة زائدة. We have four pictures. We have five words. معنا أربع صور لكن خمس كلمات. Listen then answer. Module one, revision one, listening. Activity one, listen and write the occupation of each person. There is one extra word. One. I like painting and drawing. It's not just a hobby. It's my job. I draw portraits of people. I usually draw portraits of my family and friends. I'd like to teach painting one day. People say that my work is fantastic and I could become famous, but I still have a lot to learn. Okay, what about the first picture? He is a or an author, teacher, reporter, artist, photographer. He likes painting. He likes to paint portraits. بيحب اللي هو الصور الشخصية. Yes, he is an artist. Let's listen to number two. Two. I work for the biggest newspaper in my town. I love my work because I do a lot of things. I write articles and I sometimes do interviews. That's the best thing because I get to meet famous people, athletes, poets, and artists. Isn't that cool? He works for a big newspaper. يعمل لحساب صحيفة كبرى. Is he an author, teacher, reporter, photographer? Yes, he is a reporter. مراسل أو صحفي. Number three. Three. I love going out with my camera and spending all day in the streets. I usually take photos of parks or buildings like museums. Number three. He likes taking photos. He is a Photographer. That's right. Four. Four. My last story was about a young boy and his life in New York City. Later, he becomes a famous photographer. I'm going to start a new book soon. It's going to be about a family that traveled to a lot of countries. I'm sure people will like it. Number four. He writes books and stories. He is an author. He is an author. Activity two: In pairs, ask and answer questions and complete the questionnaire about your partner. هذا مشابه لأول درس درسناه في الوحدة اللي هو questionnaire استبيان. To get some personal information, الحصول على بعض المعلومات الشخصية. What's your full name? What's your address? What's your telephone number? What's your date of birth? What's the name of your school? What's your favorite sport? ما هي رياضتك المفضلة? You can do it. With your friend or classmate, ممكن تسوي هذا الاستبيان مع زميلك أو مع أخوك أو مع أي شخص تستطيع أن تجري معه هذا الحوار. Turn to workbook. نروح لكتاب النشاط. Page nine, صفحة تسعة. We have five activities. معنا خمس تدريبات. Activity one: read and circle the correct word. اقرأ وضع دائرة حول الكلمة الصحيحة. Number one: Are you a or an artist or a photographer? You take great photos. Someone who takes great photos. شخص بيلتقط صور رائعة. يكون artist ولا photographer. Of course, photographer. Number two. This is Ammar's author or neighbor. هذا بالنسبة لعمار neighbor. Yarly ولا author مؤلف. Let's complete to understand. نكمل علشان نفهم الجملة. He lives in the house next to his. يعيش في المنزل الذي يجاوره. إذن هو neighbor. Number three, Amir and Saad want to go. Amir and Saad يريدوا أن يذهبوا camping or climbing. Let's complete نكمل. But they haven't got tents. لكن ما عندهم tents خيام. Go camping or go climbing. Of course, go camping. طالما خيام يبقى camping التخيم. Number four, we always buy souvenirs awards when we visit a new place. عندما نزور a new place نزور مكان جديد أول مرة نذهب إليه 
بنشتري souvenirs or awards هدايا تذكارية ولا جوائز of course souvenirs number five and six are homework activity two complete the sentences with the present simple or the present progressive هنكمل الجمل باستخدام المضارع البسيط هو ال base form وبنضيف لها s في حالة المفرد أو ال present progressive المضارع المستمر verb to be am is are والفعل مضيف له ing number one space the kids space watch a cartoon at the moment كل زمن له كلمات تدل عليه at the moment معناها ان فعل الجملة هنا progressive مستمر طالما progressive يبقى عندي فعل مساعد am is are الفعل عندي the kids يبقى الفعل المناسب معه are are the kids والفيرب هنا عندي watch وضيف له ing watching are the kids watching a cartoon yes they are number two عمر space not like tennis but he loves volleyball he's talking here about what uh, does عمر love and what doesn't he like على الشيء اللي بيحبه والشيء اللي ما بيحبه هذا فاكت حقيقة أو شيء دائم يكون present simple يعني مضارع بسيط علشان عندي عمر أنفي باستخدام doesn't والفعل as it والفعل زي ما هو بدون تغيير doesn't like number three conversation محادثة between Tom and Mark space your father space sell shoes in his shop no he space only clothes بسأله معنى السؤال يعني هل أبوك طالما الإجابة نو يبقى السؤال مع بارئ بفعل مساعد معنى هل يبيع شوز أحذية في محله no only clothes ملابس فقط طبعا ده شيء يحدث دائما هنستخدم present simple مضارع بسيط your father مفرد does does your father والفعل معه البيس فورم زي ما هو sell shoes يبيع أحذية no he doesn't only clothes number four علي and سامي plural subject فاعل جمع Space not go hiking on Saturdays. They go climbing. Had I done fact, she daim or متكرر. استخدم the present simple don't. عشان الفعل جمع استخدم don't. مع المفرد هي هنا استخدمت does your father. لكن مع الجمع استخدم do منفية don't go. Number five and six are homework. Activity three. We're going to complete with the past simple of the verbs in brackets. هنستخدم صيغة الماضي من الأفعال بين الأقواس. كل التدريب هذا عن الـ past simple. This is a conversation حوار أو محادثة بين أن and ليزا. Hi ليزا، what؟ السؤال في الماضي البسيط باستخدام did والفعل الـ base form زي ما هو. What did you do at the weekend؟ ماذا فعلتي في الـ weekend؟ Well, on Friday morning يوم الجمعة في الصباح I change the base form to the past form. هنحول الفعل هنا لصيغة الماضي. Help في الماضي helped. فعل منتظم ينتهي ب ed. I helped my mother at home. ساعدت مامتي في البيت. And in the evening وفي المساء I go. The past form of go صيغة الماضي من go went. In the evening I went to Mary's house. وفي المساء رحت إلى منزل ماري. We space شاهدنا فيلم وثائقي documentary. Watch in the past form فعل watch في الماضي watch it. regular verb فعل منتظم زي help help it watch watch it أما do و go أفعال الرجلة غير منتظمة do ماضيها did و go ماضيها when space be it good طبعا verb to be معناها أن عندي في الماضي was أو where حاجة منهم بما أن الفعل هنا it يبقى الفعل المناسب معه was was it good هل الفيلم الوثائقي اللي شاهدتوه good كان جيد oh yes I love in the past form loved. Love في الماضي loved. I loved it. عجبني جدا. But Mary not like. نفي الماضي باستخدام didn't. But Mary didn't like it. What about Saturday? هذا الكلام عن Friday يوم الجمعة. طب ويوم السبت. What did you do? ماذا فعلتي? I stay in the past form. صيغة الماضي من stay stayed. ظليت بالبيت. And did my homework. وسويت واجباتي Another question Space you space have a nice weekend طبعا السؤال على الماضي زي أول جملة هنا عند أول فراغ عندي هنا Did Did you وبعدها البيس فورم الفعل زي ما هو الفعل مع did ومع didn't النفي بدون أي تغيير Did you have a nice weekend Oh yes on Friday morning Kelly complete Number 11 12 13 our homework Activity 4 is about a famous author 
or a famous writer عن مؤلف مشهور أو كاتب مشهور Ernest Hemingway هذا واحد من أكبر أو أعظم المؤلفين Read and tick more than one answer can be correct ممكن يكون في أكثر من إجابة صحيحة Ernest Hemingway was one of the most famous writers of the last century واحد من أكثر الكتاب شهرة في القرن الماضي He was the author of many books and he won many awards هو مؤلف الكثير من الكتب وربح الكثير من الجوائز. One of them was the Nobel Prize in Literature But who was he? واحدة من هذه الجوائز كانت جائزة نوبل في الأدب But who was he? لكن من هو Ernest Hemingway? He was born in Chicago, Illinois in 1899 ولد في شيكاغو إلينوي في العام 1899 Who else was born in Chicago, Illinois? مين أيضا درسنا قصة حياته؟ وولد في نفس هذه المدينة وهذه الولاية Yes, that's right Walt Disney Walter Elias Disney He had five brothers and sisters له خمسة من الإخوة والأخوات His father was a doctor أبوه كان طبيب When he was 17 years old لما بلغ عمره 17 عام He got his first job for a newspaper in Kansas City حصل على أول وظيفة لي في صحيفة في مدينة كنساس في أمريكا Later, he worked as a reporter for Canadian and American newspapers. عمل كمراسل لصحف أمريكية وكندية. He traveled a lot and he lived in Paris for a few years. سافر كتير وعاش في مدينة باريس لعدة سنوات. قليلة, a few. He wrote books and short stories. كتب الكتب أو ألف كتب يعني وقصص قصيرة. One of his most famous stories, واحدة من أشهر قصصه, is The Old Man and the Sea, العجوز والبحر. Hemingway loved sports, أحب الرياضة. He played football, لعب كرة القدم. He also liked fishing and camping, أحب أيضا الصيد والتخييم. Let's read and tick. نقرأ و choose the correct answer ونختار الإجابة الصحيحة. Number one, what was Ernest Hemingway? ماذا كان يعمل Ernest Hemingway? Author, a reporter, a doctor, a poet. Of course, he was an author, كان مؤلف. A reporter, not a doctor, لم يكن طبيب, not a poet, لم يكن شاعر. Number two, where was he born? أين ولد? In Chicago, in Kansas City, in Paris. He was born in Chicago. ولد في Chicago. He worked in Kansas City. عمل في مدينة Kansas. He lived in Paris. For a few years, لعدة سنوات. Number three, what did he write? ماذا كتب? Poems? No. Articles? Yes. Books? Yes. Short stories? Yes. Number four, how many awards did he win? كم عدد الجوائز اللي ربحها? One? No. Three? No. He won many awards. ربح الكثير من الجوائز. Number five, what did he love? ماذا أحب? The sea? Yes. He loved fishing. Sports? Yes. He loved football. Nature? الطبيعة? Yes. He loved camping. Can you help at the Activity 5. Write about what you and your family are going to do in your holiday. اكتب عما ستفعله أنت وأسرتك في العطلة. هذا future plans. المستقبل. Use the ideas in the box. And your own. استخدم الأفكار الموجودة هنا. And your own. وأفكار من عندك. لو حبيت تضيف أفكار زيادة. Play tennis. Go swimming. Go hiking. Go climbing. Go camping. Do sports. Take photos. Buy souvenirs. هتستخدم the structure صيغة am going to. لو تتكلم عن نفسك. تحكي عن نفسك. I am going to play tennis. I am going to go swimming. I am going to go hiking. هتتكلم عن your family أسرتك. ممكن تتكلم عنهم إجمالا تقول they كلهم مع بعض. وممكن تتكلم عنهم كأفراد تقول my father is going to take photos. My mother is going to buy souvenirs. My brother is going to go climbing. My sister is going to go swimming or go hiking. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Inshallah. Goodbye.